What's up guys? I'm back with another video here from Mr. Central. And today I will be showing you how to fold the all new hammerhead plane. So without further ado, let's get started. <laughs> to take the top right corner and fold it down to the left side of the paper. So I'm going to do that. And then the next step is we want to unfold that. And we want to do the same thing except take the left corner and put it on the right edge. Make sure you really line it up so that we can get an X on our paper. I'm just gonna tip my corner there. So once you have an X on your paper, you're gonna take this edge, your right edge, and fold it down on this crease that we made right here. And then we're gonna do the same thing for the other side. So basically, we're just taking this edge right here and putting it on this crease over here that we made. So I'm just gonna line it up and then crease it. Now, the next step is we are going to want to fold the paper in half. So, let's do that. So, we can get a center crease. And we're going to unfold that. So now our plane should be looking like this. We should have a plus on our paper. The next step is to take this top area and fold it down all the way to the bottom. Remember your layers could get a little wrinkled, so just put your thumb in there and then nicely and gently crease it. We don't want any wrinkles on our paper. Okay, now what's, once that's done, we will take this edge right here, our new edge, and fold that to this crease of our second X that we made. We're gonna do the same on the other side. We are moving on to the final steps of our plane. And so the next step is to basically, you wanna like fold it up, not too much so that the paper rips, but you want, just wanna fold it up as far as it can go. So you see, there are two points there. If I go too far, don't don't outstretch it. Like that's basically what I'm trying to say here. Now once you've done that, we are going to fold this edge into center again. And then we're gonna pull our edge out, let this be. We're gonna put our edge right on top. The next step is to fold it in half so we can have a lock on our model. So I'm just creasing it in half, like so. And there it is. So, now we're going to be folding the wings. We 
just about want to fold it right down to the creased edge, except a little further. So you take a look at what I did. I folded it like about like half a centimeter away from the bottom edge. And then, now I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. I'm going to take it and fold it down. So, there you have it, your all new hammerhead. And if you have any limbs sticking out, just tuck them back inside this area here. So anyways, this is the all new hammerhead. And so I really like this plane because it really darts through the air as it glides. And so when you're flying the hammerhead, you want to aim at an upward angle. If you're going for distance, throw it everywhere. If you're aiming for something that's like gliding, you'll want to like just throw it a little lighter. And it can still glide, I'm not going to deny that. So, anyways, this is an awesome plane. Um, I will regret that you may have had a tough time folding it if you're new to folding paper planes. And thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time.